boy, that escalated quickly. I mean, that really got out of hand. The president will be updated momentarily by the team. What was he doing for the last several hours while they were in these meetings? They were having conversations, right? They were on the hill. Uh, the negotiators. But how how would he? Yeah, but how would he be updated if they're still having conversations on the? It just ended moments ago. Uh, look, look, Peter. Look, wait, look, Peter. Look, Peter. We're going to give the space the time and the space to have these conversations. That's what we're going to do. The president is going to continue to be updated regularly, daily, as he has been for the past uh, couple of days. And that's how we're moving forward. Us. That's how we're, we're seeing uh, this process. The president has sat down twice with congressional leaders very recently to hear them out, to have the conversation, to talk about his budget, to talk about the urgency getting uh, of getting the debt limit done of congress doing their job and so he continues to he continued to hold the line in that very in that way and so look we're going to have the negotiators have their conversation <laughs> they just ended uh, their uh, last convening if you will and they're going to reconvene i'm certain of that and so the president's going to get an update from his team as he did last night as he done the last couple that actually was pretty funny. <laughs> per the entry, go to the holiday. Can you give any more details on where the Secret Service found cocaine in the West Wing and how it got? So, as you know, this is under the preview of the Secret Service. They are currently investigating uh, what happened over the weekend, so I would have to refer you uh, to, the Secret First, to the Secret Service on all of this. But one thing that I can share, that I'll, that I'll uh, share a little bit more information. <laughs>